everybody, it's So Fresh Diamond, and today is the day that I finally show you guys how I get this ball and how I also decided to use the bang thing. This was supposed to be a Toya, Toya Wright, I always want to say Carter, but a Toya Wright inspired look, but I did not want to do the ninja bun. I just don't like ninja buns, and that's just when you use a sock and you roll the hair underneath and it's like a donut i just don't like that i like bigger fuller hair at the top so um if you guys are interested in how i got this look and using the bang thing please stay tuned um i'm not going to do an outfit of the day because my video is terrible not video but my camera is terrible quality so i am in the process of working or researching on getting a better camera that would do better outside but i'll show you guys just a little glimpse and it's just like a little um dress that i have on i'll show you guys So this is how the dress looks. Okay, so okay, so if you guys are interested in how I did this look, please stay tuned. Bye. I am finally going to do my bun today. I took my U part wig out and I let my hair air dry. So my hair is a lot thicker and bigger than what it usually is if I was to blow dry my hair. Um, today I'm going to be using the bang thing as well as the donut. And I'm going to recreate the Toya Wright. I want to say Toya Carter, but the Toya Wright look. This is just a sock. I'll post a video, not video, but post links on how you can make these little donuts. And I'm just going to use this as my bun. I have two of them just to get it kind of thick. And I'm going to be adding some extra hair, which was my Tiffany's curly hair, to make my bun a little bit thicker. I don't know how it's going to look, so I may leave it curly or I may uh, straighten the hair. So, my hair is very, very thick. I'm six months post relaxer, so only thing can hold my hair right now is the eco styler and this is the moroccan argan oil styling gel and i'm just going to take a good amount and when i want to get more precise with my edges i'm going to go back and add the eco styler to my edges so i'm just making sure and i'm going to use this hard brush that i got from sally's and I'm just going to put my hair in a high bun. And now, like I said, I'll get my edges the way I want them to be as soon as I get everything in the way I want it to be. And the back of my hair is usually the curliest, so I just want to make sure I grip all that. Okay, and just push all this back. Okay, so I'm going to take my sock. And if you have thicker hair, you can, you know, you don't have to add any hair, but I want to add hair. Well, I might not even have to.
Let's see something. I'm gonna do it like this because really, like my hair is so thick. Okay, so I'm going to do one without the sock and weave and then another um, with the sock and weave because my hair is very, very thick and I wasn't expecting for my hair to be this thick. So, you just comb all your hair to the front. Okay. And then you take it like so and I'm going to use Barbie pen And because I want the ball to be kind of big, I'm not necessarily doing the bun tight. Like, I'm not wrapping it around tight. I'm just barely doing it. And how many pins you use is totally up to you. It's up to how thick your hair is, how many pins your hair need in order to even hold. And I'm just going to pin this back down right here. Now, when my hair is not so fluffy and when I use a blow dryer, I could um, the hair would actually be less frizzier. And honestly, I don't even like the Ninja Bun, but I see it look different on other, you know, on some people it looks different, on some people it looks better. So, um, I really don't too much care for the Ninja Bun, but I think I'm going to do um, a tutorial on the Ninja Bun as well. And some people, to get this look, you can frizz. Um, not frizz, tease your hair at the ends and that's what I actually was going to do with the um, weave track that I was going to use. You could actually just tease your hair to get it to look frizzy and big. And really now I'm just still securing it down because I hate wearing buns and it just falls. And I'll probably throw a little bit of holding spray on it okay so that's how I do my bun if you want you can add a headband okay but like honestly if you want to do this we'll bring it all the way up right there So if you wanted to do it like this, you're more than welcome to. I'm going to move this over a little bit. I'm just going to take this, swoop it around.
Okay. Okay, I'm just going to spray some of this on to get rid of the frizziness. And this is just the Moroccan Argan Oil from Organics. And then just to hold it in place, I'm just going to spray some Garnier Fructis Full Control Holding Spray. You don't have to use holding spray, but I feel like mine is going to fall down. Okay, so I'm just going to do mine like this. I did not use the sock. And to cover up that top piece, my hair is super, this is super jet black and my hair is like, <laughs> like a 1B. Oh God. brush that I got from Sally's and I'm going to correct my edges and I'm still using the eco styler and I think that side is okay and you can use a toothbrush if you want This is my bun, and it is very frizzy. Okay, and you guys let me know what you think. And if you guys want to see me do the ninja bun, just comment below and I'll make a video specifically for that. Um, but yeah. Okay, so this is it. I hope this video was informative. If not, you guys know that you can comment below and I will comment back and let you guys know um, what to do. And if this wasn't a too much detailed video, you guys let me know and I'll remake another one or something, I don't know, but we'll get it right.